Okay, hey everybody, Dead and I just walking. wanted to talk about Graves today, and how they removed a cigar from his splash art. Clearly, it is no longer in a splash art, as we can see here. But, in-game, he still has it in his in-game icon for his splash art. Okay, so Graves clearly doesn't have his cigar in his splash art before the game starts and in the loading screen. So yeah, as everyone can see, in the bottom left-hand corner, Graves has his cigar still, and it's hard to tell in the icon there. It doesn't look like he has the cigar in the icon on the minimap, but the bottom left, he clearly has his cigar still in the splash art. Not sure if I just forgot to remove it, or if they did it on purpose since it's in-game rather than the splash art. But the splash art for sure doesn't have the cigar, while the in-game has the cigar, and I just find that a little weird that they don't match. Well, I was inside of the bot game trying to find this grave cigar glitch. Uh, this trundle pointed out a glitch where you can put a ward inside the Baron before it spawns, and then, well, you can't really be killed because you have to click on the Baron to get to it. Pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. Hey everybody, I'd like to thank you guys for watching the video with the Graves bug that I saw. How in the bottom left hand corner he clearly has his cigar, well in his normal splash art he doesn't. And that's really weird why Riot would do that, every other splash art is the same with the in-game that I know of. Also, I later found out a bug because the trundle showed me it in the game where if you place a pink ward at the Baron before it spawns, and then when the Baron spawns, you can't actually click on it. Like, I know I'm on his team, so I couldn't show it fully, but you couldn't click on it if you're the enemy. You'd clearly click on the Baron instead. And there is a command to click on things, like not to attack and just to move, or not to attack enemies and just to move, but not many people know the hotkey for that, and you'd have to actually change it, so it could kind of be game-breaking. Plus, I'm not even sure if that would work on the ward, because I'm pretty sure it stops all attack commands. But, who knows. Uh, and thanks, guys, for watching the video. If you did like it, then thumbs it up. If you didn't like it, then thumbs it down. In the comments below, what you guys thought about the bugs slash glitches that I showed in the video. And remember to subscribe if you guys liked the video. Thanks, guys, and have a great day. Peace.